This is this is this is not quite yet two years in, but basically two years in. What's up? It's your girl Haish back again with another video. And this video is just gonna be me doing a two-year post big chop update. Clearly, the length is lengthening. So it started at like nothing and look at me look at me i could use a trim but i'm still very very happy with my growth okay so far like i said we're not yet at the two-year mark i still got a couple months and a lot can happen in a couple months is all i'm saying this is a like dried stretched braid out like my hair was stretched and then i did two braids and this is kind of like the aftermath of that and all i put in it was the um leave-in conditioner this is my new product right now that's what i'm using right now. get it get your ipad from cheyenne Yeah, I used that, some water. I haven't really put anything else in it. It is kind of dry right now, but it is still soft. Um, usually when I use leave-in, I do still put like some type of cream in it. I've been out of my concoction and I have still not ordered. Need some new, new shea butter. I've been saying I'm gonna go to a local African store to get some shea butter physically, but I haven't gotten around to that. I just, for some reason, it's just so hard for me to get out the house. I make it seem like somebody else or some extraneous circumstances are stopping me from getting out the house, but it's really just my crippling anxiety of like all the different possibilities that can happen. Like I said, I watch a lot of movies, so my imagination is just like wired. Like I'm always, I'm ready for the craziest scenarios okay like i'm i'm yeah it's like that two years post big chop i have not used any heat on my hair at all i am thinking about getting the press going somewhere getting 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 the treatment getting the ends clipped getting a nice press and seeing what is given because i know it's gonna be given but I'm thinking about holding off. I don't know. We're going to see. We're going to see. Like I said, it's been like maybe six, seven years since I've put any heat in my hair. Really? So, yeah. All I've been doing is protective styles. Not a lot of um, extension hairstyles, but I have sprinkled a little bit up in there, here and there. Um, but I typically stick to the low manipulation type styles, my braid outs, twist outs, my two braids. I would just wear like the braids or the twists as is. And I would make sure my hair is properly moisturized before I put it into those hairstyles. So I'm putting in leave-in conditioner, I'm putting in actual moisturizer, I'm sealing it with oil, I'm oiling my scalp, I'm massaging my scalp in between hairstyles while it has the hairstyle in i'm massaging oil in it um sleeping with a bonnet or a scarf on at night to protect the styles or extend it for however long i want to extend it i have been misting my hair with water i like to say misting because it's the difference between spraying and misting and i prefer misting not spraying the girls who get it, get it. The girls who don't, don't. If you don't get it, then you're a girl who don't. But I'm gonna tell you. The mist, it looks like a mist. Like, I, I like it. I like how that hydrates the hair versus like a spray where it's just like a singular spritz of hair in one direction and you kind of gotta do more work redistributing it. 
There is giving, period. And that's pretty much it. That's all I wanted to say. Give y'all the tea on what I've been doing. I wash my hair maybe between weekly and bi-weekly, depending on how I'm feeling. As far as regimens, you just need to do something consistently. It can be inconsistent, but consistent. You know what I mean? Like, you can do it a couple of times one week and maybe only do it once the next week, uh, the next week, and then maybe the week after that, you do it a few more times than you usually do it. You know, just, just have some balance in how you're doing things. And... It's gonna work out simple as that so yeah I just make sure my hair is properly moisturized I put it into those low manipulation hairstyles and I just live the rest of my life and then after the hairstyle has lived life with me and it's time to do it all again I wash it condition it moisturize it style it and repeats basically that's that's the keys it's it's as simple as that those are the keys like i'm about to pass a couple of people up mm, again you know what i mean and it's it's really sad but not nah. <laughs> let me stop let me stop no i'm about to i'm about to run a lap around some people and these are people that always be giving me pushback when it comes to me giving them hair tips and hair suggestions or they don't follow my hair advice and i follow my hair advice and i start from level zero and i pass you up like that's a problem it is it's a problem and if the shoe fits you know you know what to do 